Okay, so the chorus is meant to be a literal allusion to kitchen folly. Then maybe we can add some baking metaphors for the verses. So is the folly supposed to involve normal kitchen utensils or the process of baking? Now that you mention it, baking implies a more docile undertone, but I can throw it off with some sassy lyrics. Good idea, Pharrell. Oh, then we may want to change this to a low key from the pre-chorus to really sell the effect. <laughs> you know, I admire your thought process, Ari. Salty with a hint of sweetness. Oh, your album could be like a uh, Maroon 5 song sugar, 2.0. <laughs> and with that, we've completed today's writing session. What's next on the agenda? Well, let's see. Uh, all that's left is your photo shoot for the new album cover. And then you've got to fly to New York for an interview on The Tonight Show with Jimmy Talon. Excellent. Wait, now? You don't, you don't want to take a break? You're joking, right? We've barely worked an hour and you're suggesting that I take a break? This, my career, everything I've worked so hard for is nothing like an ordinary job. I'm on a roll, in the zone, and I can't seem to stop. It's important that we use that energy to our advantage. While I'm still young and able to have fun. So are we going to waste this opportunity, or are we going to jump on it? Well, um... <laughs> well, well, by, by break, I meant for like a short coffee break. Like, Starducks. Oh, oh, definitely. <laughs> Starducks is the only exception. <sighs> so this is co-producer life, huh? And it's too late to turn away now. This town so lame, I'm feeling so wired. It's 4 a.m., I'm not even tired. We're in your car, we can drive away. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're almost there, I'm loving this feeling of something new. Just write what I needed, take me there. We can drive away. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. to a situation or to someone else's life or somebody else who brings light to your life or sweetening the situation. Fascinating. Great. Well, maybe you could tell us a little more about the songs you're writing for your album. Okay. Well, why not? How about I just tell you guys everything then? <laughs> okay. So another song that we wrote that's also kind of an intro is called Raindrops. And then there's another one called R.E.M. Wow, raindrops and R.E.M. <laughs> okay, you're just spilling all the tea about your new album to the audience today. Oh, there's more. <sighs> ah, dangerous woman! Uh, Ariana? Pete? What are you- in my break room? I was waiting for you to come back from your photo shoot. <sighs> Didn't think it would take you long to finish. Oh, oh no, Pete, right? I forgot to cancel our hangout because of the interview. I'm so- Apology accepted. I get it. Festies before besties, right? Cheesy, but yeah, that's one way to put it. Oh, actually, I, I got some news. Oh, well, it's more of a surprise, so... Here, cover your eyes with this. <laughs> okay. What is it? You can only imagine. I'm so excited. Come on. What's so special you need to cover my eyes for? You really want to know? Yes. Are you ready? I was ready five minutes ago. Just do it. Okay, you can take off the blindfold.
Yo, that's probably the most gorgeous picture of you to date. And it's upside down. <laughs> Thanks. Actually, the surprise is that you are the very first person in existence outside of my team to see the official cover art for my new album. Uh, hold up. What? Surprise! Yes! I've never had this opportunity in my whole lifetime! <laughs> easy, easy. Oh, congrats, Ari. That's awesome. I'm, I'm so proud of you. But why me? If anyone was going to see your album cover first, it could have been your friend Aaron, your brother, or even Mac. Let's just say that those three were already checked off my list in the past. But why though? Really? What makes me so special? You kidding? You're already so special and you don't even know it. You may not believe it, but I do. Now that's cheesy. <laughs> <laughs>